Hey, what's up everybody? Brian here with the J-Line Network, helping others achieve greatness in every part of life. And today we're talking about a SWAN account. What exactly is it and how we can build one? Here we go. All right, before we get started, I wanted to let you know that we will be putting some links in the description as a resource today to help you build what we're talking about today. All right, I'm gonna jump right into it and I'm just gonna let you know a SWAN account stands for sleep well at night. Sleep well at night, mm -hmm, I like it. Now within the J-Line network, we have what we call the J-Line experience for maximizing potential. And this is our life, health, and business coaching. Now within that coaching, we have what we call the J-Line financial formula, which is a four-part formula, and it's kind of a secret, so don't tell anybody. And that J-Line financial formula is return, give, save, live. And it's kind of a secret, so don't tell anybody. Now, with this SWAN account, we're actually putting that in the save category. To sleep well at night is something that you're gonna save for the future. Now, in the formula, we have for return, give, save, live, we have certain percentages that we recommend. Now in this video, you're gonna hear us recommend a lot of things, but we need to let you know that we are not financial advisors, so please do your own research and due diligence. Now let's get back to the video. We have certain percentages that we recommend that you would do. So for returning, we would say about 10%, for give 10%, for save 30%, and to live off of 50% of the income that's coming in. Wait a minute, wait a minute, there's no way I could live off of 50%. Now, some of you might be saying something like that. However, this is something that we're working towards, so it's not gonna happen tomorrow, but to sleep well at night, you have to ask yourself, what would it take for me to sleep well at night? What kind of money, what kind of resource, what do I need to be able to sleep well at night so I do not have to worry about the future. Now with the return, give, save, live formula and the SWAN account being in that save category, save being 30%, we're recommending that the SWAN account would just get about five to 10% of your savings. Now, you might say, well, I don't have a savings or I'm not saving, but let's say you just put $100 aside uh, for savings each month. Now, what that means is we would want to allocate between five to ten dollars of that hundred dollars into a swan account, something for the future to sleep well at night. And like we said, this will build up over time. Now, some of you might say, I don't have time to wait. I want to get a thousand dollars or two thousand or three thousand and just put it into that account right now. And that's great, but not everybody can do that, but they want to be able to sleep well at night with their SWAN account. And let me tell you, the SWAN account is more than just money. Now we do recommend that you do this in baby steps. So imagine your monthly expenses and trying to get one month of expenses into an account or being one month ahead with all of your finances. That's the first step. Yeah, 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 this might take a while. For some of us, this might take a long time. For some of us, we could do it like that. And the point is that we're making steps towards that swan account towards our future and so how do you do it one you just set aside a little bit of money each day until someday you're like one month ahead wouldn't that be awesome and then the next goal is to get three months ahead and then that's one quarter of the year ahead and then you can get six months ahead and then finally one year ahead imagine living one year ahead with your finances with your resources and you can truly sleep well at night knowing that if nothing if nothing came in and, and you lost everything as far as like a job, an income or whatever, you would have one year to, uh, to recoup or to, to live off of. Okay, I think I'm getting it now. Now some might be saying, hey, you're calling it a SWAN account, but I've heard of this before. This is called an emergency fund but it's more than just an emergency fund and it's more than just money. It's about being ahead and being able to really sleep well at night. So one thing that we did is we had some money and we were like, hey, we have some money aside, we have a little bit of head, but you know what, we also have a freezer. Why don't we buy a year's worth of food and put it in the freezer. So we have meat for an entire year. Whoa, that's a lot of meat. You might say, you know what, to sleep well at night, if any of the electricity goes off, I think I would love to have a generator. So instead of having five, $600 
in an account just sitting there, why not just buy a generator and that is part of your sleep well account or your sleep well at night resources. Now the interesting thing about this is sometimes people don't even know how much their monthly expenses are or how much they would need to be one month three months, six months, or a year ahead. So it takes some calculation to find out what not what my income is, but what are my expenses. A lot of times there's two things that kind of couldn't go wrong. Is One is we're thinking that we need to replace our income rather than our expenses. Now the other part of that could be our expenses actually exceed our income. Now that is uh, a whole different video. And you might say, hey, I don't have enough money to go buy a year's worth of meat or a year's worth of food or a generator, but the point is to start saving up towards that. And then here's a couple little tips that we did when it comes to emergency food or being ahead when it comes to food or having a freezer uh, that's full of food for your future. One thing that we love doing is we love doing delivery services like ButcherBox where they send meat every month link in the description. We don't eat it all, but we save some of it so that that builds up over time. Another thing that you can do is you can go to places like My Patriot Supply, link down in the description, and you can get emergency food that lasts 25 years. You could put it in your pantry or in a closet or in your attic or wherever and be able to sleep well at night knowing that if something happened, at least you had food to eat. So think of it like this. You can have all kinds of money but if you don't have food, man, that's hard to sleep well at night. So make sure to have food, water, some things that will actually sustain you. I guess it'd be hard to eat if all you had was cash and all the shelves at the supermarket are empty. Now you're gonna want to have some cash on hand, but how much cash on hand do you want and how much cash on hand do you need? In fact, some people might say, you know what, in order for me to sleep well at night, I don't wanna have my money in the traditional banking system, so I'm gonna get me some crypto. Link down in the description. Another thing that you can do is you can buy in bulk. Now buying in bulk, you might say there's no way that I need that much food. But you buy in bulk, you use some, you freeze the rest. And that's how you can build up your reserve. All right, I know that was a ton of info, but basically we're trying to help others set up some type of Swan account so you can sleep well at night. And if you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to the J-Line Network so you can stay up to date on all things to keep your life great. Until next time, see ya.